Hello YouTube. Today on Vintage Kit Reviews, I have a bit of a treat. Um, this is a kit that I had been looking for for a very long time, and finding it for a relatively decent price is getting to be very difficult. Um, this is the 125th scale John Deere mold board plow. This was kit number 8012, and it was number 12 in a series. So, taking a look around the box here, have kit number there on the side. Again, this is in 125th scale. And then, kind of goes through the different things that it has. So, the hitch steering link actually is operational. Like that. So, let's crack this box open and take a look here. So, it's going to seem like a very basic kit. Um, they actually released two different ones. They released this one as well as one for Massey Ferguson. Um, they were completely different designs as well. So it's not like they just did a relabel and printed those. So you can get a little bit of information there on the plow itself. A nice picture of the completed model. And then go into the instructions. So we start by assembling the plows. Make six of those, making the heat sewage, making the tire units, and then starting the construction of the wheel assemblies. Coming in, there we go, creating the actual main board pieces here. Like I said, very simplistic in its design. Um, there's not a lot of parts. It's only like 70 is what it said on the box. So very limited in its part count. Um, but again, it's a, it's a very rare kit. Um, these are not, as far as I'm aware, they've not been reproduced by anybody. So whatever was released back in the 70s is kind of what it is. So you kind of follow process through. And then final cutting, or the cutting guide for the vinyl hose. So, like I said, pretty straightforward. Have a thing here for basically warranty information. So, there's that. Very small decal sheet, only a couple of decals of John Deere, the number for the plow, John Deere symbol, and then the caution shield. Going into the kit, I'm going to go ahead and leave these sealed again just due to the fact I don't want to lose any parts, but uh, the tires are here as you can see and are molded in two pieces. There's the one half, here's the other half down here. We have the main plow blades themselves, very nicely molded. Pretty much no flash on the edge. It's a very, it comes to a very sharp point there at the tip of the blades. We have the wheel backs here in what's supposed to be a John Deere yellow. Probably will repaint the hubs when I go to actually do this. Have vinyl tubing here, two different sizes of vinyl tubing, or a couple pieces at least. Looks like they might be the same diameter. And then the actual main body of the plow itself molded in again what is close to being a John Deere green but again, I'll probably get a can or some paint of John Deere green and paint that up. Review. So, again, really short review, but of a kind of obscure kit that not many people know about. Hope you guys have enjoyed the look at the John Deere moldboard plow from Earl. Have a wonderful rest of your day.